Welcome to episode of Potion Sword Run. Potion coming at you from my bedroom. In this episode, we're going to talk about Concord and how the roster is making the usual suspects cry. But before we begin, again, do not like this video. I am still wanted for stealing my neighbor's cats. They keep on knocking. And I won't let them in. Concord is a hero shooter that is coming out from Sony Entertainment. It was received very poorly by the gaming masses because it looked pretty much just like a ripoff of Overwatch. They all kind of do. I think this game has its own personality, but that being said, I don't think it's going to be a big hit like Sony thinks. But the usual suspects, you know, grums, smashes of the world, are complaining about the roster and that it lacks white people. They point out that it has a bunch of different other races. It has South Asians, it has a few Latinos, it has a bunch of aliens, it has black people, four black people. Oh my God, you can't put four of them together. You know what happens? So as of right now, it seems that there's no white people. But when you look at these aliens, Especially the main protagonist in the videos, I'm not sure, you know, in the game. He, although is an alien, a green alien, he's a white guy. I mean, look at him, the way he talks, the way he, his demeanor, he's, for all measures, white. So if you guys cannot relate to any of these other Latinos or, you know, black people, you have these aliens who are practically white that you can play as. Now, imagine, like, back in the day, when all they had was white people. Imagine everyone else complaining. Black people complaining. Hispanics complaining. The Asians Like, everyone just complaining. Hey, where's, where's all the map? No, never happened. We just kind of went on with it. And as the times went on, they started representing more people. And because they started doing that, now they think the word inclusivity, like when you work at a place that has a bunch of different races together, is a bad thing. So what do they want? Do they prefer that these game studios or anybody that advises them is just full of white people? Is that what they're suggesting? Because every time they see inclusivity or they see anything like that, they call it DEI, they call it this, and obviously it's against the white man. No, come on, y'all. Now, I just find it hilarious that these guys are complaining about lack of representation in video games. This is what they're doing now. So... I don't know if the tables have turned. I'm not sure if they're all just SJWs in my eyes. I don't even look at that when I look at the roster. You know, I look at try to, cool characters, you know what I mean? Try to see which one looks neat, which one has cool powers. I'm not looking at their race. That's craziness. You know who looks at race? Racist do. <laughs> I just fuck it with you guys. Oh man, so this game Conquered obviously has other problems. Um, it has up, an uphill struggle, but it don't need all this bullshit, you know. This is just the bullshit that these people click on, um, you know, their brains click on this because that's kind of all they're looking at for video games now. They're not looking for video games to be fun or, you know, cool characters or anything like that. They're trying to look where they can get the outrage at. And the lack of a white person in the roster is their outrage. This is their latest thing they can click on to. And they're going to do it. Because it gets them their clicks. It gets them. It gets their hate mob what they want. Now I don't know if the game's going to be good. I probably am not going to play it. Um, but we'll see. Let me know what you guys think. If you guys think the lack of a white guy in the roster so far. We don't know the full roster. We just have a clip of the roster. And they pointed out who is who in it. Let me know if it bothers you guys. Let me know if this is a big point of contention for you when it comes to playing this video game. Is that the reason why you're not going to buy it? Or is it for other reasons? Don't be like them, guys. Rise above this stuff. Enjoy the games for what they are, not for what they're not. And if you don't happen to see a white guy in the roster and it hurts you so bad, just imagine how everyone else that wasn't white felt back in the day. This shouldn't hurt you. Just play the video game and have fun. That's what they're for. But these guys, Grums, Smashes, Melody, Me Melanie Max, 
they want you guys to think that these games hate you when they don't even know you. <laughs> so it's not about you. It's about making fun games. But they try to take the fun out of it. Just remember that shit. Because that's all they have. They got to feed the mob. And this is the latest way to do it. No white people on the roster. That's going to do it for this episode. Catch you guys on the next one. Peace.